Spacebar sounds nice. Flying, thank you so much for the prime, bro. Wendy's nuts, TKL, Alex, Zotty, woo. Dude, I, I have a feeling like tonight's gonna be all Wendy's jokes. All right. So this is from, this is from Kibu. It's designed by, uh, gosh, I can't remember exactly who. It's in the title. Rustworks, it's designed by Rustworks. I remember that, that wasn't a cheat. I didn't look at nothing. But I think this is different from the other Wendy TKL because it doesn't look anything like it. The back weight does, because I guess this is, is this Wendy's signature? Listen, I, I have, um, I am very blessed to have like all these, uh, in the last week, all these boards come through that are um, based off of K-pop idols, but I, I honestly don't know too much about them. Oddly enough, I had a few songs saved from both of these bands and my, or both these groups from my, uh, in my Spotify list, but I don't know too much about this. Disaster, thank you so much again for the 11 months, bro. And Uwu, thank you so much for the tier one, dude. I appreciate you, dude. It's the K-pop board, it is. That's Wendy's signature. Okay, so that explains why the, the signature looks. You know, I have to admit though, the, the little wide smile there. So nice. If that was just on the back of the board, like just that little wide smile and not Wendy, I honestly think that would be a fire logo for the board, bro. I'm not even kidding you. That would be such a fire little logo, just that little wide smile. Uh, this should be a raffle. Chung didn't give me too much details, so the Kibu store didn't give me too many details about this. Just that it'll be released really soon, so I don't have too many details, guys. Uh, nothing too crazy. O-ring top mount? No, I believe this is just top mount. I don't think this is O-ring at all. And then yeah, we have our uh, plate, which is a really pretty color. It matches this uh, really, really faint, like light pink. It's a very nice anno, I have to admit. Very, very nice. Info page will be up soon. Is it top O-ring? Oh, is this O-ring compatible as well? It kind of bothers me that the Wendy logo is off-centered though. It's centered here though. You have to understand this is where it's centered. Does that make sense? Actually, is it centered like that? Yeah, it is. I believe it's centered like this. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's centered to the 60. Ah. I don't know if I agree with that either, but it's such a small detail on the inside that I don't know if it bothers me too much. Oh, we got a little Heine PCB going on here too. No daughter board though. Interesting for a if this is, because I'm not too sure if it is, I don't really have much info on like the mounting style other than top mount, I assume. Actually, is there even screws in this? We'll find out, guys, because uh, there wasn't a whole lot in my package. If there wasn't screws, I'm sure I can find something to screw it in. Let's actually unscrew it right now. Like in terms of overall design, I think this is really nice. There's a really pretty curve. Like you guys can kind of see it over here. It tapers into the center. So you guys can see that and then it kind of curves out, giving a really, really beautiful, like almost like a three-staged wedge, four stage, if you even want to consider this little, um, I forget what this is actually called, but it's really pretty. Like the board has a lot of character to it. it looks like it has front, a low front height, which is nice too. So that's awesome. I don't know if we have a uh, exact front height on that, but yeah, pretty nice. Like there's nothing absolutely wrong with this. It does not have a centered USB-C. It's not too far, um, so nice. I guess, sunken in either, but it's still enough, I'd say. But yeah, it's really pretty. Little prototype, little lip on the front here too. That's what gives it sometimes that like, you know, it allows it to kind of have that lower front height as well. Yeah, good quality for everything here too. I don't know if this has been pre-built at all, but it's in very good condition and it looks great. The Anno match was perfect, by the way. Um, even just taking another quick look, it is an identical Anno match. It might be a little tough to see because the reflections. But yeah, look at that, perfect. Beautiful, very pretty color too. Uh, become a full DJ and start playing Final Fantasy. No more MMOs, no more. I can't do MMOs, dude. Uh, that's something that I, it's not that I, I don't want to, it's just, I know I'm going to get hooked into MMOs like no tomorrow. No one wants that. Not even me. 
Only you guys want that because you guys would laugh at it. Same boat? Yeah, no more. I got, WoW is, WoW was the, the last one I got super hooked on and before that like Guild Wars 1. You know, I tried New World. I got interested, I was like kind of interested in it at one point, but I, I was still playing WoW at the time. Oh, but isn't that all, isn't that all of Blizzard? Honestly, it's one of the other reasons I don't really care for Blizzard these days. They kind of just seem like they, they don't know what they're doing anymore with that company. This is taut now, so we're gonna grab this. It's been a long time since I've watched one of your streams. ZT, what's going on, dude? A commissioning service uh, like you, but I'm thinking of doing custom mouse commissions. Oh, custom mice are pretty sick. Still, I feel like that's a very under undertapped market. Um, kudos to not having a point of contact underneath the space bar. Thank you for that. Oh, this looks cool with the switches in. That looks good. Look at that. Oh gosh, my girlfriend did something that she clapped about. Don't know what it was though. She tends to forget I stream. Uh, that's an interesting color. <laughs> so hyped for this. Me too, dude. I'm a, I'm more into like BTS than I am Blackpink. I'm not really a Blackpink fan. They have a few good songs, but I tend to feel like their music has like a, a certain feel that I'm just not into. Is this a yay or nay to this set? I think this is a yay. Imagine she's lurking in chat. <laughs> That'd be interesting. That would be an interesting turn of events. Would it not be? Definitely a yay. What are these keycaps? I like them a lot, actually. These are, this is from Frank in Penbird. Geek Arc Mono Hangle. Okay, okay, okay. All right, let's put this to the side. Ooh, look at this. This is nice. Dude, this turned out sweet. I need to adjust the, the color of this camera. Or maybe it's this camera I need to adjust. Let me turn this down one. Ooh, this has a nice feeling to it. Very, very beautiful looking keyboard. Awesome looking side profile, by the way. Honestly, the more I look at this, the more this grows on me. This seems there, like it's not impressive in any way. I know sometimes you can get a really pretty seam, um, but man, the side profile on this is pretty hot. It, it looks really good, the side profile. Here, we'll get it from a, this angle as well. That's a really nice side profile. Then you got the bottom over here again. Even this little area of machining looks sweet. And then the Wendy logo. Well, the Wendy signature. That looks pretty nice too. Looks nice, dude. How heavy is the board? It has weight to it. I can already tell this is super comfy. I would love to try out the O-ring config of this. I don't think I have any O-rings that would fit this. You know, okay, Tony, let me tell you about why I actually prefer these feet now. Someone brought this up to me one time and now I prefer these feet. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. With other feet, if something happens to them, um, you are not finding replacements. Like if you get one of those like weird, like longer, but if something happens to this, you just need to know the shape and you can buy these off Amazon. So I feel like in the long run, like these feet are technically a little bit nicer because I don't know. I, I've fucked up some like feet on the other keyboards and I just, I don't have any more. Or sometimes it's just, it's fallen off. Like one of my key cult feet fell off. So, all right, let's see what this sounds like. So we're using PBT keycaps for now with Cherry uh, Ultra Glides. They're lubed and filmed. I don't know what they're lubed with. I'm assuming 205G0. This is the aluminum plate. There's no foam or anything. Uh, and this is the Wendy TKL from Kibu. Uh, designed by Rustworks, not to be confused by the other Wendy TKL that's out there. So let's see what this sounds like, shall we? Spaceware sounds nice. Ooh, it's hard to type on this.
It's very crisp sounding. I like that. It's very loud. It's a, it's a top melt. Where, again, where I think this is gonna shine, I do feel like the alphas are a little bit too metally. Um, met, metal, like they have a very metallic sound signature. Uh, it has a very metallic sound signature. I think that's coming from a top mount though. It sounds very top mounty. Like again, this is typically uh, what I think top mounts sound like. I think a PC plate for this will make this shine, just like the Suse. Because I think the Suse is a good example of why I think PC and top mount. PC and top mount would be our perfect combinations. I would love to see this in PC. I think it's gonna sound literally identical to this because they're pretty much the same internals. So some notes about this. I will say that the uh, alphas do sound a bit metallic-y. I like all the mods though. Even the space bar sounds really, really good to me. All the mods sound great. Again, I would like to see this in a polycarbonate plate. Uh, I'd also would love to see this in the O-ring config as a Wendy stand. Yeah, I mean, the board still like, even in this config, I still think this sounds pretty good. I would still probably use this. Yeah, I still think this sounds fantastic. Again, a little bit leaning on the, oh, maybe not a little bit, more than a little bit. I'd say it's definitely like hitting metallic notes from the alu plate being with top mount. Um, where I think this can be better so nice. is a polycarbonate plate or just using the alternate uh, mounting style, which again, I wish we had an O-ring. I would have loved to try that today. I do wish this is recessed a little bit more. It's kind of shallow and I do wish it was just a, it feels almost like trivial how shallow it is. So I guess when we're really, really analyzing this, I would have preferred it to have something, well, this is a bad example, but a little bit more deep in that case. But, uh, but yeah, have a great afternoon and evening and morning wherever you guys are from. Love you guys, good luck. Space sounds nice.